Question number one. Which person schedules and oversees all of the web programming and multimedia work by the website development staff? A. The web administrator. B. The web developer. C. The web project manager. D. Web programmer. Question number two. It is important that the work of the multimedia designer A. Match and fit in with the overall theme and concept of the website. B. Conform to the standards of the Multimedia Design Association. C. Be as small as possible in order to fit within the website's parameters. D. Consist of scalable images to adjust to the different website viewers. Question number three. The person who designs a website is called a A. Web Programmer B. Web Developer C. Web Project Manager D. Web Consultant Question number four. The core responsibility of the graphic designer is to A. Follow the instructions of the web developer B. Create images and text that appeal to the user C. Design graphics that are pleasing to the eye D. Present information in a way that is both accessible and memorable. Question number five. Which of the following is not an aspect of a web page that an SEO specialist uses? A. ULR tags. B. Meta descriptions. C. Internal links. D. Keywords. Question number six. Graphic design is a vital aspect of website construction in that A. Search engines favor websites with better and more pleasing graphic images. B. Many people make a decision to stay on or leave a site based on its visual characteristics. C. Visually appealing websites are easier to navigate. D. Websites with poorly designed graphics suck. Question number seven. Which of the following is not a duty of the web project manager? A. Meeting with development personnel. B. Scheduling the tasks of development personnel. C. Reviewing and updating web page content or links in a timely manner. D. Organizing the client's content for the site. Question number eight. Which of the following is true? A. The web administrator oversees the testing of the website before it is ready to be activated or made live. B. The web project manager will help users compare products and find the client's business within just a few mouse clicks. C. The web programmer is responsible for designing and maintaining databases that are associated with websites. D. The web developer is responsible for designing and maintaining databases that are associated with websites. Question number nine. Who is responsible for backing up the source code, applications, and related data to provide for disaster recovery? A. The web administrator. B. The web developer. C. The web project manager. D. The web designer. Question 10. Which of the following is false? A. The web programmer may develop the user interface or UI portions of the website. B. After all of the coding for the website is completed, the web developer submits the finished product for the beta testing phase. C. The SEO specialist reviews the work at various stages of development to ensure that the site's content, both seen and unseen, is optimized for search engines. D. The multimedia designer is responsible for choosing or creating the music and sound that will be played in a website. Question number 11, bonus question. What does WWW stand for? A, Wide World Web. B, Web Worldwide. C, World Wide Web. D, World Wide Wall. Question 